hello everyone welcome back to reptiles and resin so today i am doing no video for cleanup i i mean cleanup i'm doing cleanup that's why you don't see the heat mat here but we're going to do an unboxing for bb craft today because it just came in and I want to share what we are going to be doing yes if you don't know about bb craft they are awesome they are have a YouTube affiliate program. If you have a hundred or more subscribers on your YouTube channel, or probably even like if you're an influencer and you have more than if you have a hundred or more subscribers to your any channel, I guess like TikTok or anything or anything like that. But this is the YouTube program that I'm in. Then they will send you free products to try for them that way they can try to get some you know momentum toward their their um selling and they have really really good products i have not found a product and as you can see they package their items extremely well which i absolutely love unless you want to get them out <laughs> And then it takes a minute. So have you a pair of scissors ready? That's all I can tell you. Yep, have you a pair of scissors ready for unboxing their stuff? <laughs> okay, so right off the bat, let me get all these. We have molds and we have findings. So we're going to get into this. I always save my bubble wrap can always recycle okay so now this one is a like a rectangular tray I believe well it's not square yeah rectangle um tray sorry for the you know how it is and oh goodness with this set of trays you get you get four trays or four tray molds gracious well none of them look bit I see a little dent in that one and it's very little I don't see any in this one but they're not out of shape you know like some of them would be like over the side they're all in shape they look really good okay and they look really good. Now these trays are, let's see, the the inside of the tray mold is 170 millimeters by 80 millimeters. But the whole mold itself was 182 by 93 by 12. And that's all in millimeters. So I'm going to pull out tape measure so the inside of the mold is almost at eight in eight centimeters um the i always call that the width the length on the inside of the mold is seven centimeters or it would be three almost three three and a quarter almost wide and then it would be little bit over six and a half I would say six and three quarter in no yeah six and three quarter inches and that's just the the mold what the inside of the mold that's not the entire mold but you get five of these molds in one set the honey hand silicone tray molds resin casting molds for UV resin epoxy blah 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 crafting make craft making like I said, it's the rectangular pattern. And it you get it says one piece, but you get four in that set. And it is 881 for all four molds. So you will have four tray molds. And they're actually a really good size. Okay, we're going to put that over there now. This one right here is the 
Honey Hand, Honey Handy, I, I apologize, Owl Pen Holder Silicone Mold, and you get two with this set, and it was $10.92. The measurements, I think just for the mold itself, is 83 millimeter by 72.5 millimeter by 92 millimeters. And it's like a owl pen holder. It's but you get two of them. You will get two of them, and you don't have to use it for pens. Oh, somebody's hairs on it, or fuzz. I see his little eyeballs. So, oh, this this is a really thick mold. Yeah. So yeah, he a little owl. He looks like he would be pretty deep. I know you can't really see his features, but he's an owl. And they're both exactly the same. So you get two in the, the set for $10.92. And yeah, I, I can't wait to pour those. And this is our last mold. And I have been eyeing this, and I thought it was adorable. I can get it open. It is the Honey Handy Egg holder silicone mold and it is for your refrigerator to hold your eggs so you will have a six count of eggs that you can make your own holder with and i just thought this was absolutely adorable yes and i i can't wait to try this one now with this one and it's made really really nice thick mold not flimsy so this one is the Honey Handy Egg Holder Silicone Mold um, Resin Casting Molds for DIY Egg Holder Tray Making Usable in Kitchen Refrigerator And it is 145 millimeters by 100 millimeters by 37 millimeters And you only get one in this set so it's only one and it was four dollars and 76 cent on their website at the time of purchase now i'm not sure if the price has changed or not but yeah i can't wait to do this one and that is it for our molds that i let me go on and put him back in the bag right now that's it for our molds and to be honest with you this is the first one we are making tomorrow because I want, I want this in my refrigerator. <laughs> okay, ooh, that is heavy. Okay, and I got some more of these. And it is a huge set. The Only Craft 400 piece resin fillers antique steampunk gear charms. Eight color. UV, I guess you could use it for in UV resin. And also for filling accessories for jewelry making decoration. So that one set, and it is heavy, was $9.59. And it, it, like I said, it is heavy. And it's by Ollie, Ollie Craft, or Oli, Oli, I think it's Oli. That sounds better, Oli. And they come well packaged. Oh, I don't think I'm going to be able to slide that off. So I'm going to have to tear this off. I could have just used the scissors. Oh, and they are inside this box. Oh, oh how do you open? Oh, I got the wrong end. So inside this box, they are also individually bagged to their color. So yeah, this is like a, a light gold. You've got the copper. You've got the gold gold in color, like a bright gold. That's like a light gold. And then you have, uh, I would call this a silver. Just regular, like a bright silver. Let me move this out of the way so I can lay them out. And then this is more like a gunmetal gray. I love the gunmetal color. To me, it's like black, silver black. I, I love gunmetal grays. And you got some clock hands in here. I'm, I think each bag has the exact same thing in it. So we're going to open one. Now, this is more like a bronze because it is, 
is darker. See, this is the copper. This is the bronze. Now, these, I'm not, I would say this is a antique gold here because it's antique. And I'm not sure what kind of gold this is, but it's another gold. It's like a mix between antique and gold. It's a lighter version. But actually, that is really pretty. Yeah, so you get, what is that, two, four, six, eight different, well, yeah, it says it in the description, eight different colors. But, uh, yeah, let's just open one of these. And like I said, each bag has the, I believe, the exact same designs in here because that's what it's looking like to me. So I'm going to open these up. And let's see what kind we get. I'm going to just spread them out here. So we got, these are the claw cans, and they're pretty good size. There's two of those. I think that's the biggest one you will get right there. Claw cans. I like the little claw cans. Ooh, what is that? Ooh, that's like a uh, little itty bitty bitty claw can. Ooh, I can't even pick them up. Oh, there's two of them. No, there's three of them. The little itty itty bitty, but those would be perfect on the earrings. They're so small. So yeah, that's what you get. And like you said, you get 400 pieces total of each. And these are all our claw cans. Do I have all those in the shot? Yeah. Okay, and like I said, these are the biggest pieces right here. Those are the claw cans. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, forty, fifty, six, seven, eight, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty, one, two, 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 three, two, four, two, five, two, six, seven, two, eight, nine, thirty, thirty three, thirty six, thirty nine, so you get forty in each. One, duh. Eight times four. <laughs> Eight times four. 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 Eight yeah, I like those little itty bitty tiny hands, but they are the same in every single one. So, or are they? Wait a minute, I just seen one that I don't see in here. Hold on, let me see. I just seen one in here that's not in there. So maybe each bag is different. Oh, I love that gunmetal gray. Goodness gracious, mighty. Yeah, see, they don't have one of these in here with the little. Where you can actually put that as a pendant for a necklace. Yeah, and see. Okay, so maybe each one has. This one doesn't have as many caulk hands. I only see two caulk hands. Okay. So maybe each bag is different. But that is a good value because let me tell you, I went in the Hobby Lobby. And I'm telling you, it looked like maybe 15 pieces in there for like $7.99 for a little bag. Yeah, they, they're kind of high. Especially if you buy them in store. But these are some really nice. I love this gunmetal gray. It's my favorite. Now I gotta pick them all up. Let me scooch them out. Now I'm not a steampunk person, but I love the gears. You know, I, I, I do like the way the gears look and things. I think they're very, very pretty. Especially in a clock. I love them in coasters. And I love them in keychains. And they would also, like I said, some of these will make really cute ear... Oh, excuse me. I got the hiccups again. I don't need to grow anymore. They make some pretty earrings with some of them. I actually think just the little clock hands will make cute little ear dangly earrings hanging down. But yeah, you get a good little bit of that. 400 pieces for $9.59. I mean, seriously. Like I said, 15, about probably about 15 pieces of Hobby Lobby is like $7.99. Yeah, and they're a lot smaller than these, let me tell you. Alright, so we have one more item I picked up, and that's the create cabin one box 20 piece five style rabbit charms and they were 719 for these enamel um charms and i love little bunnies 
Mr. Bun Bun outside. But yeah, I, I love these little bunny charms. I have seen them. And I finally saw them on uh, BB Craft. And I was like, oh my goodness, I would love those. And they have two different kind of bunny charms. But this one was my favorite. So you get this one. Pretty little bunnies. Let's see, how many do you get a piece? Let me see here. Did it even say? Oh, five styles. Okay. Well, Lord. Is that the same? No, that is, though. Okay, so I think you get four a piece. Yeah, four times five is 20. <laughs> so that is the little white bunny with some cherry blossoms around him. Well, he's not really a white bunny. He's like an antique white bunny. So, yeah, he's cute, though. You get four of those. And they're... I would say they're bigger than a quarter. The circle is probably about as big as a quarter. But with the flower sticking out, I know it's bigger than a quarter. And then you have these in his little Japanese pagoda. Pagoda. You get four of those. Now, he is a lot whiter. So, he is a little white bunny. And you got the cherry blossoms. He's going up to the, the temple or whatever. You, the little Chinese temple. Or Japanese temple. Asian temple. They're all beautiful. I love Asian art. Japanese and Chinese is so beautiful. Okay, so we know we get four of those. Uh, this one is so adorable the way it is with the little leaf around it and him sitting in the middle and some little blooms coming up from the vine. Now he's a little small. He's about the, the circle looks to be about the size of a nickel. So yeah, he's a little smaller, but with it sticking out, it's a little different. Okay, let me move this one. These are adorable. I, I love these little bunny charms. Okay, now that's that one, that's that one, that's that one. And then we have some more with him. This actually, uh, um, to be honest with you, this looks more like a kitty cat than it does a bunny. I mean, look at it. That really does look more like a little kitty pawing at the, the um, little flowers than it does a bunny. Yeah, I'm calling this a kitty cat. I, I'm sorry. I know it's supposed to be a bunny. But that's a kitty cat. <laughs> that's not a bunny. Look at his little tail. Bunnies don't have tails like that. Not the bunnies I know. This is a kitty cat. And that's my story and I'm sticking to it. If y'all disagree, let me know in the comments. But, um, I'm calling that a kitty cat. Yes, I am. I'm calling that one a kitty. And he is really cute. And this, oh, this one goes to this. He's going into the little pagoda. Now, this one's like, it's got the stars and the moon and like the little sky. And he is a little bunny. He's got a little yellow flower on his little neck. He's a cutie pie. It's like Bun Bun. He'd be out all night roaming the neighborhood in the backyard. Well, his rabbit neighborhood. <laughs> so, yeah, you get five different styles. And they are all cute. Uh, to be honest with you, you get four rabbits and you... Four style rabbits and you get one style kitty cat. Because I'm calling this a cat. I don't care what anybody says. To me, this is a kitty. So, yeah. It's a kitty. Does it say anything about kitties on here? <laughs> Well, it just says, rabbit charms, bunny pendants, enamel, colorful flower, animal bunnies, pink so sakura leaves, hollow round pendant for jewelry making, DIY Easter holiday bracelets. Yeah, these aren't Easter bunnies. These are just beautiful bunnies. Um, and... And one pendant of a kitty cat. <laughs> but those were, I don't know if I told you the price, but they were $7.19 for the 
for a box of 20 and they are made really really beautifully I love these these are the smallest ones and they would also make a beautiful pair of earrings and that's probably what I would do with them make a beautiful pair of earrings those are adorable and then you could you'd have two pair of earrings yeah those would be awesome for earrings I don't like they're not heavy so they would go in my ears very well awesome I love these these are awesome so tomorrow you know, I always like to do something with the order once it come in. So tomorrow we will be making our egg tray because I've been dying to do the egg tray. Yes, I have. I'm not going to put these back in the bag. I'm going to put them right in here because I'm going to transfer them over to my my bead bin anyway. Well, not bead bin, but my my um charm bin. And like I said, I most likely will be making a pair. These would be perfect to wear in the springtime. They really, really would. And they're like a rosy gold. They're not a bright gold. But yeah. Go shop BB Craft if you haven't. Or at least go check them out. They are awesome. They have wonderful prices on things. I mean... Most of the, like I said, if you go in the store, even with a coupon, you're not going to get a good value like you would on this stuff. You really would not. You really would not. So, yeah. You really would not. Oh, I might make a pair of earrings tomorrow, too. And this. Yeah, cause I'm kind of, I'm really, really feeling those, those um, bunny earrings. So, we are going to be doing this on our next video. Yes, we are. Oh, Lord, I can't shut it back. I'm telling you, this thing is stuffed full. 400 pieces. And they're not 400 pinky finger um, size. They're like quarter size on down. And they're not all small. I'm telling you, there is awesome sizes in here. And that makes me happy because somebody that's going to give you 400 charms, they're probably going to be the smallest little things you've ever seen in your life. Not these. These are awesome. Yes, they are. They are awesome. All right, you guys, that wraps up this unboxing of BB Craft. Like I said, I, everything will be in the link in the description of where you can find these if you want to buy any of them or you can just go check out bb crafts website you might find other things like i said they had other rabbit pendants on there they have a lot of molds yeah you're gonna spend a few hours looking through molds if you go on there and just type in molds yeah good luck you're gonna be there for a minute so um get a cup of coffee and sit down and relax because they have a ton of molds. Yes, they do. But this egg mold is adorable. I can't wait to do him. I cannot wait. He's going to be so cute. And if you want a dice trinket tray mold, these are really good. This one is not that deep. Actually, it would also be good for, um, long as your coffee cup isn't too large. You know how some of them, I have some that's really big base, but then I have some that will fit on this too. You can have your tea and cookies. Put your little cookies on one side, your tea or coffee and biscuits. It's up to you, but that would be a good little tray for that. And it really would. Oh, yeah. And we're going to make some pin holders too, or makeup brush holders i actually want to make one and replace that jar over here that i got everything in but i will see y'all tomorrow we will be making our egg storage tray for the refrigerator and a pair of earrings see you soon bye for now